Fernandez and I'm an art teacher. Visit my website at pattyfernandezartist.com. Okay, let's draw. Today's project is how to draw the goddess Sekhmet, which I know I said wrong, which is the lioness Egyptian god. I take three fingers from the top in the center and I put a dot. From that dot, going towards the left, I'm going to draw a curved line down, come back to the dot. On the right, I'm going to draw another curved line down. Come back to the left, we're going to draw curve line, curve line down, and stop. And on the right hand side, we're going to draw a curve line, curve line down, connect. I come back up to the left, and right about here, I'm going to draw a big curve line out, in, connect, jump over, and on the right, I'm going to draw a big curve line out, in, connect. Inside, I'm going to start on the left and I'm going to draw a big curve line up, straight line down, curve line, curve line. Come on the right hand side, draw a big curve line, straight line down, curve line, connect. Come back on the left, we're going to draw a curve line, curve line, connect on the left. Come on the right, curve line, curve line, connect on the right. Come back to the left and inside we're going to draw a curve line and then one, two curve lines inside. Come on the right, curve line on the inside, one, two curve lines inside. Come all the way down to this space. We're going to draw a straight diagonal down and a straight diagonal up. Starting on the left, curve line once, twice, three times on the left. Come over on the right, curve line, curve line, curve line on the right. Okay. Now I come over on this section of the left and I'm going to draw a slightly curved line down, curve line over, curve line up and leave it floating. Come on the right hand side, slightly curved line out, curve line in, curve straight line up and leave that floating also. Right here, I'm going to draw a big curve line down, over, up, and connect. And now I can attach, connect that line on the left and this line on the right. Okay? Now I come back over to the left and I'm just going to draw a curve line down on the left and come on the right and draw a curve line down on the right. Okay? I come up to the top and I'm going to draw a curve line up and over and on top of that I'm going to draw a circle. Okay? Now we're going to add decoration lines. Watch what I do. On the very top part we're going to draw thin skinny mini little curved lines all the way across this top section. We're going to come down to this side panel, but this time we're going to draw vertical lines going straight down on this side on the left, jump over, straight lines going down on the right. Now we come in the center Starting here, we're going to draw curved lines going across, keep going, and now on this section right here, we're going to draw little straight lines all the way around. Now, this looks kind of intense, and it is, but once we start coloring, you'll see how it all works out. Keep going, keep going, 
keep going all the way up and I think we're done okay let's see how we're gonna color this in okay so that you can see the actual lioness part this whole section in here is going to be brown because this is the face so we're going to make this all brown this is brown and we're going to bring it down to this section because this is the body parts but I'm going to do an ABAB pattern because I found another color brown if you have browns inside your crayon box pull out all the browns because you can use all of them on this coloring project once I've done that brown now I come in with a different brown now some of you might say I don't have a different brown that's okay what you can do is do one use your regular brown and just color dark and light but this is basically your lioness and this is all her body face section same thing with her eyes you can do two color browns but I would do the centers black okay now the rest of it is decoration so what I did was is I found a gold yellow this is supposed to be the Sun so I did that and I did this section right here kind of a yellow gold if you don't have yellow gold just use your yellow I brought it down and did some yellow gold here on these headdress stripes so I did these kind of yellow gold and then I found two blues one blue I use for this section of the stripes so this is a blue and then the other section I used was a turquoise blue all the way around this is like a necklace so she's really kind of dolled up all the way across but then to still maintain the lion part I came back in and I did the other section brown so it's a turquoise blue with a brown that also ties in with her other colors okay let's see what this looks like all colored in okay here's my lioness goddess Sekhmet which I'm sure I'm saying incorrectly but I'm trying who is the Egyptian goddess um, ancient Egyptian goddess in Egypt she's very regal okay bye bye